Hello everyone, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, good sitting at the bus station, good waiting on an airplane to taxi in. My name is Master Fong 357 and welcome back to Resident Evil Village. We took a break yesterday, played some Elden Ring, got back at it with Destined Death, and now we're going to continue our foray into the wintry wilderness with Ethan Winters. Stronghold. Pardon me as I wake up, but I'll come into my own. My manic energy will soon take hold, and I'll start rambling and dithering and blithering about as I always do. As I recall, we're looking pretty damn sexy here. Yeah, we've got a lot of flash grenades, a couple of babams, good amount of sniper, shotgun, and more than enough pistol. Also, three mighty soup cans, some healing, two lockpicks, not sure what I'm going to use those for, and a magnum. Dookie. Welcome. Talk to me about my free ammunition potential. Nothing in the magnum. Hmm. Pay four for that. Ah, it's fine. All finished. Sitting on two hundred eighty-one thousand dollars. Nice. All right. So we got. Please do take a look at my new stock. We got money. We got lots of money. Today we're heading up to the uh, well to Hagrid's, as it were. We're heading up to the stronghold, and we're gonna take a detour into the mill, which means we've got at least two big bastards to deal with. And if we get some keys or treasures down there, we're going to have uh, lots of stuff, lots of stuff to take care of today. Good day, then. The flash grenades are going to help. The abundance of handgun ammo is going to help. The question is, do I want to upgrade the shotgun's Speaking power? Of something in particular. I am going to. As I have said before, I'm definitely going to get the other shotgun. One moment, please. Ooh, we've got free shotgun ammo. 48 large for the Magnum. Uh, in my first playthrough, I'm, I'm a sucker for Magnums. I upgraded this one full, and it's powerful, and it's helpful. I just don't want to put all that money into it right now, because I know I want the late-game shotgun. Absolutely need the late-game shotgun. So we have pillaged the village. Everything is blue. All the treasure chests are crossed off. We love to see that. I don't see any more... Animals for us to slaughter. There might be some meat down here now. I'll have to take a peek. But yeah, we are uh, we are heading to the mill. We are going to. Yep, there's the goats. We're gonna mess around with the lycanthropes. Oh, it's open now. Oh, you son of a bitch! Get back here! Get back! Don't you kick! God. Except the fate! Nope! I require the meat. It must be done. Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! You silly Billy. You silly Billy goat. God, they're fast. Uh, uh, no, wait, I'll hold off on that because I think it's fun some Zambos. It's not actually hurting me, right? I feel like I've tested this before, and yet I feel like it might actually be hurting me. We'll just keep taking it on the chin, and we'll see. Alright, okay, alright. Oh my god. I need your meat. It's nothing personal. Thank you. The Duke has to eat, and me by extension. It's Black Phillip from the hit movie The Witch. <laughs> More than that, I guess. Yeah, we, we, have, we have bigger fish to fry here. Pun definitely intended. But uh, we need to get this goat meat first. Oh, also this slab. I'm pretty sure we can head back to Beneviento now. Yep, there it is. It is Claudia, I was correct. Hmm, so now that we've got the slab and the meat, that actually is... I think that's three bosses we're going to be facing today. The question is, do we want to go face the boss before the mill? I wish I could remember where the ball was. Welcome, Ethan. That's what I'm missing. I'm missing the Beneviento Garden ball. 
And that is the last treasure up that area. I would hate to run up there and take on the big man without Food the ball. Uh, Duke to your kitchen, away. All right, so this requires five meat, and I've only got four. If I wait for one more meat, I can get the, that's the permanent increase, but this is health permanent increase. Ah, but I still need two more poultry for this one. That's fine, all right. Let's give you one of Don't those. Don't yet. And three of these. So we just need two more meat, two more poultry, and we have every dish. You have an eye for quality. Thank you. All right, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna head to the mill. We're gonna head to the mill. We're going to try and use all of our supplies to adequately snuff out all who would oppose us. Hopefully, we'll find some more meat and poultry up there. This area is one of the most interesting to me. I, I, I like most things in this game. I wish we got a little more, a little more explanation, or a little more uh, flushed out. Like, there's this castle stronghold, and you even read a note from a person, and it's like back in medieval times, and it explains why this area has been undiscovered and untouched. Like, there's this kingdom, I guess, trying to work their way into the village, but they're being held back by a bunch of fucking monsters. So it's like, sir, we have to abandon the post. It just, there's no way we can do this. Let's try to remember this play. Like, I think there's there's a boss here, and they want us to bring him outside and use these explosions to our advantage. But I, I don't think you actually can get him outside. I end up just... just killing him in the mill. Locked from the other side. Oh, the humanity! Ah, yeah, that's a goat. Goat awarding. We got all the goats long ago, in, in a life, in a separate life, time long past, we murdered all the goats. The wooden goats, I, I guess also the real goats. We needed meat, I think that was established. Pig! Pig! Run! Don't wait. You've got meat. A few more meat, and I get myself my torture de pork. I think that's the one that we're missing. There we are. That hog's got some. That hog's got some power. Free things? Why? They wouldn't be setting me up for a boss fight, would they? Where's the crystal fragment? Where are you at? There you are. Well, this looks like a cozy, wholesome place. This might be a nice place to rest up. Relax. Surely nothing bad will come of coming in here. Surely nothing bad will come of coming in here. They, they give you like four opportunities. They're like, you want to turn back? You want, you want to turn back now? You got to turn back, right? You still don't want to turn back. All right, how am I going to open up on this man? I think we're going to start... We're going to start with landmines. Make another one of these for now, just to be safe. Landmines, maybe a flash grenade for distance. Probably shoot at him with the rifle, try and get some shotgun in there. I don't want to use the magnum just yet. I'm saving the magnum for uh, something worse. Hello? Now, if this guy was the singular enemy of this place, I think he'd be really cool. But the fact that he shows up, like, one or two more times, it's just a very lazy copy-paste. I was disappointed. My friend! My friend, don't be cruel! 
Oh, no, that didn't do anything to him. All right, evasive maneuver 12. I really gotta come up with another sound for running away from my life. It's just so easy to whip out, you know? Where you at, sir? There you are! Yeah, Tiny pistol popper! Pistol packet bomb! Oh shit, that's right. When he screams, I think we're in trouble. Yep, there it is. Oh no, sir! Thank you, thank you. We we, we don't we none of that. The flyers still around? I think they are. Soup can. his lasers. Ah, explosive round. Very nice. That was close. Don't growl. Please don't growl. Hang on, managing my inventory, sir. All right, we still got some soup cans. We have four grenades, so yeah, let's start using those. Oh yeah, big hoss. Oh, there he is. Did that do anything? It did! Bizarre! Don't go screaming again. I, I would really appreciate it if you did not scream your head off. Oh god, blame it. No, 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 not Y, A, L, A. Oh, hi! Hello! Welcome to the party. Walk out of my way. We're on the move. Pivot, pivot. Let's see, what is that? Explosive flash. Yeah, I've only got one explosive left. Yeah, let's let's load up another flashbang. Take it on the face, my chop. I'm not gonna say this is going well, because the second I do that, we'll be in trouble. She can pipe bomb. I might give him a magnum shot or two. Yeah, I might I might put one in his dome.
Ah, that's all it took. Not gonna reload, though. We might be able to get free ammunition soon. I like thinking about all those long nights at the redacted military outpost location, with Chris teaching Ethan how to turn rusty nails and broken lunchboxes into World War II landmines. I do too, Atticus. And then you remember that Chris says Ethan's out of his depth, and he doesn't want, you know, he's, he's not gonna be able to handle anything here. And he's just getting in the way and a bunch of other vague, veiled threats, so I, I think Chris is saying that Ethan could never cut it. Ethan Winters never had the makings of a varsity athlete. Alright, one explosive, five flashies, good ammo, decent ammo, and we got a giant crystal axe. Opens the Sammy. Oh. Opens the Sammy? There it is. Oh, that's right! The meat shack. How could I have forgotten the meat shack? Is there poultry though? I need poultry. I don't need fish. I need poultry. I do technically need meat, so I'm fine with that. But poultry! Got one poultry. I think we need another poultry. Oh, I missed an item in there. All right, we're gonna go back. Take a take a quick peeky poo. July 8th. Today's the day the Jolly Merchant stops by. He always gives me old newspapers. I know Miranda forbids them, but news of the outside world is always so fascinating. There was one thing that piqued my interest in the last one. It was an article about some medicine company. Oh, I don't remember the name, but their emblem looked familiar. It was the same symbol on the giant's chalice. I'm pretty sure I saw the same one painted on the walls in a cave, too. That radiated umbrella image really stands out. What's some outside a company emblem doing here? I wonder if it had anything to do with that man that stayed here all those years ago. Nah, I'm overthinking it. Now I'm dead, hanging from a fucking wall. And what's our prize? Father Nicholas's Angel! Which is a, uh... For you <laughs> uncultured swine, that's actually an easter egg to the movie Hot Fuzz with Simon Pegg and Nick Frost. It might be a, a complete, it might be completely happenstance, but I think it's an easter egg. Because his name is Police Constable Nicholas Angel, and well, here we are. Father Nicholas's Angel. Could be coincidence. Could be a coincidence of the highest order, but I like to believe that they they understand quality films. Oh, that's right, the rifle ammo. Cool. All right, well we're definitely sitting pretty in the city now. A rifle, magnum, explosivo, shotgun. We're gonna be using all of our shotgun in the coming areas. I just know it. Yeah, that's right. The good old boys. Where was the sec? I thought there were two explosive containers. I guess there's just one. Oh, no, there are two! That's what we call high caliber efficiency. Are there are two of you. Oh, here we are. Excellent. And the man I shot in the face. Excellent. Everything is coming up rosé. We're gonna go back to the Duke and we're gonna drop off our meat. Uh, I'm a little worried, because I've been very efficient here, and I, I don't think I missed any chickens. Oh, hello. But, I think I still need two more poultry. You know what, I'm gonna head over to the fallow field real quick here. See if there's something terrible. Yep. Yep, something terrible is up at the field, and we're gonna have to deal with that. Eventually! 
Having just fought a big axe wielder, I don't want to go up to Beneviento yet. I think I'm going to go through the stronghold, and then before I go to Heisenberg, I will head up to the Beneviento garden. Because, damn it all, how did I... Or have I been holding it the whole time and I'm just an idiot? No, yeah, like... That opens the grave, I know it does, and we have to deal with a, uh, a boss. But somehow I missed the Beneviento... Oh, good. I was just treasure ball to pass the time. Yeah, I still need one more poultry. This is fucking annoying. However, we can do the job of the pork. I can hardly wait. Just excuse me a moment. Here it is. Please join me. I will join you. Watch, 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 watch. Not a bad dish. And we'll drop off our poultry, yet. but we need one more chicken. Where's the chicken that I missed? Because once we get through this area... Yeah, there's, there's no more. I couldn't have missed a single chicken. I will never forgive myself. This is all an investment, Ethan. Uh, yeah, we don't need the fish, and we don't need the meat. All we need is one more chicken, and we're we good to go. We'll sell Father Nicholas's angel, then the giant crystal axe. Ah! And we're building up our fortune so we can Do get that shotgun. You let me know if you find anything else of value. Well, we got one grenade. Uh, you know, Duke? Oh, yes. Uh, let's talk for a minute. Uh, your recipes? It's 3,000. Mine's are 3,5. Let's... I'll purchase that, and I'll purchase this. Thank you for... Uh, oh, okay, so these require one and one metal scrap. That's what we have very precious little of. One metal, one gunpowder, and an herb. Yeah, that's... That's not gonna work. I need my herbs. Yep. So we could craft a bunch of pipe bombs. Patronage! We've got two explosive rounds... A bit of shotgun. Shotgun is rusted chem and gunpowder. I've got plenty of that. And we can't upgrade. Shall I choose something for you? We've got free shotgun ammo, but we don't have anything else here. The best bangs for your box. Thank you, Duke. All right. We will meet again soon. No more horsing around. Time to go to the stronghold. The map should tell me if I... Yeah, see, I killed all them chickens. I killed all them chickens. I went to the mill, and I got rid of all the meat, so... There's one final chicken hiding somewhere. Uh, Pottersfield? Who wants to leave Pottersfield? I also know once we go back up there, there is more meat. I know that there's a goat running around up at the Beneviento area. We got everything down there. We got everything over here. Oh. We found it. We found it. The final chicken. The final piece to the three-piece meal. The legendary KFC combo! We've done it! I'm happy I looked at that map, because uh, I, I know, I'm like, there's no chicken up at the stronghold. Yes, it's hiding back here. The final piece to the puzzle. The last dish. Oh, my little cuckoo cuckoo. Oh, of course, that's right. This is the crank door. I completely forgot about this area. That's right. Once you come back from Moreau's with the crank, you can get back here. Oh, that 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 answers a few questions of things that I was missing. Oh, it knows. It knows I'm coming for it. It knows that I'm going to boil it up and fry it up and make some chicken croquettes. Your time has come, a chicken. <laughs> Ugh. <sighs>
This is all an investment, chicken. Alright. So... Very good, very good. Now we can head up here. And get another final piece of the treasure that I was like, where, where do I find this? I forget, before I talk to the Duke, did I go and use Luisa's key? Yes, yes I did, and I got, not Googly Elmo's plate, but uh, the other one. So we run along this here snowbank, and look, on top of the roof, a treasure chest! With the pigeon blood ruby. Three guesses where that goes, everyone. Uh, where... Where could this... Where... Which one... Which one do I combine it with? This? Uh, oh, it's this one! And we've got the Dimitrescu's necklace. An ornate necklace made of pure gold and two rubies. Alright, well that answers my treasure question. That answers my chicken question. The last thing we're missing is the ball for the uh, House Beneviento Labyrinth. That question too shall be answered in time. Let's go cook up some vittles with the Duke. I'm going the wrong way. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. This way, Papa. Just finished Stranger Things' uh, first volume of the final season. I think it's I think it's pretty good. I think they went back to their roots, and I'm excited to see how they wrap it all up. Some good twists, some very good gore. Welcome, Duke. I have the chicken. Thank you. Voila. How to cook. Here it is. Please, join me. Dolce tour de pui. Munch, 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 munch. Not a bad dish. And with that, we are fully upgraded. Ethan is a strong boy. He is a healthy boy. I don't need this poultry duke. You can have it. Hard times, Ethan. You can also have a Dimitrescu's necklace. Not two lockpicks, but definitely going to save those. Those are important. A good deal, if I say so myself. Oh, hey, eating food restores your health. I didn't know that, so that's awesome. If you have enough ingredients to make a dish, you can go from red health to, to green health. That's, uh, it's like free health and like free ammunition. Wonderful, wonderful. All right, now we'll save because we have acquired everything. We are going to head up to the stronghold. We're going to take care of everything there, and then the last thing we do before going to Heisenberg's factory is heading back up to House Beneviento. And honestly, if I can't remember, or I don't find the Beneviento ball by that point, I'm just gonna Google it. Because I've come too far not to get everything. And I've done it all before on my own, so I've got nothing to prove to anyone. Least of all you. Least of all myself. Definitely least of all myself. Yes, grr, you're all very spooky. Wait a minute, are you actually behind me? Oh no, you're just being spooky. Yeah, 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 you're just being spooky. Hey, who's spooky, bitches? This part, I both like and don't like. I like the climbing the hill, I like fighting all the lichens. I don't like that there's no backstory to the chief of the village, who we call Hagrid. I don't like how the lichens just kind of keep coming until you... It's kind of like a... Like an infinite wave until you rush forward through them and, and activate the keys and the stuff. Where my lichen brethren at? I hear you jumping down. It also sucks that they have bow and arrows. That's not a fun time. It's not a fun time for anyone. Aha! My guard has increased! You'll never get through me now! Aha! My god, it's a priest! My powers have doubled since the last time we've been together, Lycanthropes. 
still has a lot of head get ammo to deal with these assholes. Twice the hair, double the fall. That is why we get the better shotgun. The Forbidden Woods. That man was kind. Very kind for sitting there and taking it on the chin. Bastards! Wait, did I just learn how to reload cancel? <laughs> That'd be something. What did I say shotgun ammo was again? Two rusted chem and gunpowder. Yeah, we got that. Shotgun ammo, best ammo! I just gotta make sure that I don't go too far to trigger- Oh, well, oh, I think we've triggered. Mm. You bitches. Right, the growling has commenced. This is where I'm torn between greed and just getting through the area because it stops the stupid fucking lycanthropes from spawning. And I don't think- I don't think it's, think it's good game design to have an area with- with like goods and survival horror that is also like, no, 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 stop, stop fighting and just- just keep going. Just keep moving. Seems to go against the core. Now, if you go through an area that's got tons of enemies and then once they're all gone or dead or you've beaten the room, you can go back and pick up all the goods, that all makes sense to me. You know, it's like, you survived, now go pillage. Wasted that completely. I think we need this. This is gonna this is gonna help us out a lot. Oh, he's still Was that explosive or flash? Oh, that was explosive. Whoops. We wanted to use our flash grenade. How do I get this door open? Again. Whoops. That's fine. We had healing to spare. Now we have three mighty soup cans. Oh, did they actually stop coming? Okay. I know that there's some levers I need to activate, and I think that's going to spawn more of them, but okay. There's an explosion up there, but I don't think I can actually get up there. Is there a ladder I missed? No. And that treasure chest is a misnomer. That is underground. Yeah, we ran up here. Okay, okay. Lever one, lever two, uh, lever skiddly do. Time to employ the mighty soup cans. I really don't want to go through all of my, uh... Let's see, yeah, there we go. We got our flash loaded. Okay. There's gotta be a way. There's gotta be a way, like a big lever of some sort that I can pull with my Ethan Winter's strength. Oh lord, they growling. One of those. And one of these. But now, bitches! Oh god, I hate that. Oh, I hate the double shot. I will forever call bullshit on that. Second lever, go! This is why we need our herbs. 
I, I don't want to use all my soup cans. I'm gonna need my soup cans. Herb for that. Still looking pretty good. All right. Did I pick up all of this BS? Like, the second I step through here, I think... Yeah, like, that growl is they just keep coming, but the second I step through here, they stop. Or at least they stop spawning. They might be able to chase me up here, but I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna sit down there and shoot a bunch of guys that don't need to be shot. All right, into the stronghold. That's not even the worst of it. We still got a much more... Yeah, that's why they give you a uh, typewriter right here. Because there's, there's an area up ahead that is just... That area wasn't so bad. That wasn't as bad as I remember. It's this area here. You're inside. They come from every direction. There's a bunch of goods, but really it's like you're not supposed to stay. It's like run, get through the door. And the second you get through the door they all stop attacking, or like, they all despawn. It's like, ah, oh, you did it! You ran in a direction. Forward! Not too forward, not yet. Gotta open my peepers. I'm pretty sure there's a crystal I can shoot down in here. Find the shiny. Find the shiny shimmering in the distance. Took the scrap in there. Nothing there. Where is it? Come now, how could I have missed it? Oh, there it is. Vivianite, lovely. More money for the money pile. I think the inherent problem with lichen combat in this game is that the pistol is your primary source of destruction. And unlike 4 and even 5, where the pistol could be used to stun an enemy and then punch them to make some breathing room or make an opening for you to escape, in this one, the pistol has zero stopping power. So if you're on one lichen and you're trying to shoot him down, not only are you not going to be able to stun him, but all the other lichens are just going to beat the shit out of you. So you need to use the shotgun or an explosive device, and it, uh, it's annoying. This must be their den. Yes, the den, of course. The den. The lycanthropes den. The den of the lycanthropes. The lycanthropic den. <sighs> I gotta run around and see if I can find things before uh, they all spawn, and it's gonna any second now they're gonna spawn in. Yep, there it is. Big growls. There they are. Big wins. Winning! And it's not necessary. Uh, yeah, see that right there? That is bullshit. They, they make the game so like you're what oh that might be death everybody like you're, you're supposed to face them head on and they move slow the second you turn away they get these bullshit hitboxes 
They they close the gap instantly and they attack the shit out of you and it's it's just it makes no sense really. <laughs> Arrivederci, bitches! See, I missed something on the bottom floor. I could go down there to get it, but I'm not going to. The lichens will just keep spawning. Okay, big guy. <laughs> Hang on while you're biting me. I need to craft up healing since I'm going to need it. And let's, uh... Let's equip a pack. Shotgun. Oh my god. Push enemies away! Yeah, that works. Fuck off me, please. Heal up, heal up, heal up! Shit. Oh, damn it. Doing somewhat decent. There we go. And yeah, if, if I just ran through that door, they'd all, like, despawn. They'd all go away. Maybe my memory's a little off. Maybe you can still come back and explore, and I'm, I'm actually gonna try it right here, but the thing is, like, until you go through the door, they just keep spawning on you. Alright, what do we got? We got two flashes left. We have an okay amount of shotgun. We're gonna be using the pistol and rifle for this next area. And do I have any more herbs? To get that herb? I do. Okay, cool. So some of those many people that I killed dropped herbs. That's nice. So yeah, let's, let's see about going all the way downstairs. I mean, I only because I knew that section was coming do I think I did so well. I was like, okay, we get we get to this part where we're supposed to run, and now we shoot a bunch of grenades until everything's dead. Otherwise, you, and even then, I still got fucked against the wall and bitten like three times. Purely out of spite. What did I miss down here? Uh, there you are. Oh, well, I'm glad I came back. A little bit of shotgun. All right. Maybe I'm just bitching. But I, I remember these areas being annoying when I first came through. And not challenging, like... Oh, Jesus. Okay, yeah, see? They, they, they have spawn locations. There you go. Yep, everybody do your jumpies. Whee! Wait, did that... Did that hit me? That guy fucking hit me in the zipline animation. Oh boy. Madre de Dios. But the second I go through this door, they're gone. We're safe. Bye. Ah, uh, yeah, Magnum ammo. Okay. This is gonna be a lot of guarding and using health here. I think I'm gonna... I think I'm gonna hit Hagrid with five magnum rounds to the face, and then hopefully I can get more ammunition when I go back to the Duke. If I can't, oh well, we'll use our remaining three on the big beastie I need to take care of. 
Uh, the problem with this boss fight, again for me, is it's, uh, it's a gank. You don't just fight Hagrid, you fight Hagrid and like the three lichens that he just keeps spawning. <sighs> hey, Ratty Brat! Hello, Ember, nice to see you today. We're, uh, we're heading down, it's weekend at Hagrid's. We are approaching the Thunderdome. Hmm, that loud, ominous roar. It's almost as if they're setting me up for something. Let's squeak on through the cracks. I think what... I, 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 yeah, I mean, honestly, my personal mantra for this game would be give me more. They set up a lot of cool things, they have a lot of cool visuals, but we never really get any substance to it. Like, the lichens are bad experiments, you know, they're, they're the, uh, the majority of failed experiments. It just turns you aggressive and violent and cannibalistic. But there, again, there's no real explanation as to, like, the Chief Hagrid, why he turns into a special one. And that, that's it, the lichens are just a group of, of violent cannibals, like... There could have been more. There could, there could have just been, like, the slightest bit more of explanation. But it is be what it be do. And so forward on, we trek. Alright, load me up, buttercup. Give me all- give me everything that I need. No, 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 not you, not yet. Yeah, this. We get this tiny little snippet here of Into the Past, and, like, it's so interesting, but, again, no- no, no backstory for it. The king's orders finally arrived. Withdraw. It is most vexing that we must abandon the border stronghold to those heretics. If I had but a little more time, I knew I might be able to turn the tides of this battle. Nay, I should not put on airs. It is my curiosity that ties me to this place. There are a number of ruins in the vicinity which the locals say are very ancient. The ceremony site with four giant statues, the caves with murals carved on the walls, the stone plinth they call the giant's chalice. Where did the people who built them come from? Where did they go? Where did they come from, Cotton Eye Joe? It irks me that we must abandon this place without knowing. Yeah, it, it irks me too that, that I have to leave this place without ever getting any no knowledge myself, Mr. Noteman. I always wondered why the lichens were like the standard experiment gone wrong. I, yeah, I, I agree, Ratty Brat. Like, it makes sense that they're not molded from Resident Evil 7 because that was a an engineered version. It was a different version of the mold. Okay, so in this one, Mother Miranda is putting Kado in everything, and most of them, they just turn into hairy, violent, rapey, roided-up cannibals. Uh, Moreau, I think, is responsible for making the actual wolf versions, because he says, like, I put a Kado and then I, I injected the spine. Um, Lady Dimitrescu took, uh, was it eggs? It was in one of the files. She took eggs from the Kado and put them in the stomach, or, or the eggs hatched into insects, and that's how she made her daughter. So, like, we see a variation of experimentation. We do. I wanted to see fish people in Moreau's area, if I haven't made that clear enough already. But yeah, like, the lichens are just the standard. Except for the big lichens, like the chief, that carry big hammers for some reason. They were moving in the right direction, they just kind of stopped halfway. Alright, so what did we get? We got two explosivos. I think I'm gonna start with the flashes. The flashes will help me keep everything at bay. We're definitely gonna be using health. All right, it is time. But when all is said and done, we'll get out of here and we'll get the googly elbow plate. And I will never pronounce that correctly. Do not ask me to. I can't. I mean, just look at it. It clearly says googly elbow. Hmm. 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 Well, this looks safe. <sighs> No time for introductions, Hagrid. I'm going around collecting items. I know you're being big That's and scary good. right now. That's not good. Oh yeah, I guess you're right. It could be better. I shouldn't have told you that. I should not have told you that. Haggers? Where'd you go, Haggers? Haggers! Whoops. 
Oh, oh, really? Fucking really? Off to a great start here. That's not okay. I'm missing all of these rifle shots. How I'm missing on something so big? Jesus Christ. While they're distracted... Reloading that. He's angry. Ah, shit. You might not be able to see it, but I'm sweating profusely. Shotgun the clock. I'm in orange. I don't think I didn't think I've uh, ever seen orange. Before. Whew, all right, not too shabby. Despite all the rifle shots that I missed, oh, you actually can combine. All right, that's nice. Eat shit. Yeah, eat shit. That's what cool guys say. Cool guys say eat shit. <sighs> Well, thank you for the lurk, Ratty Bat. Appreciate it. Haggard is dead. Don't you worry. We did it. We took care of him. And we didn't even use that much healing. We did use all of our grenades, but we still have one explosive and one flash. So I think we came out on top. Keep that flash loaded. That thing's a lifesaver. We got our shotgun. You know, I didn't have to reload the shotgun. That's right. The Duke has free ammo for me. Mm, maybe I'll hold on to it. Again, I'm still, I'm, we all know, we all know I'm getting the good shotgun in just a few more clicks. Let's head on back to the Duke, see if we can get ammo for our Magnum. We'll take care of two more bosses, and then on to Heisenborg's Factoria. Dr. Berg's Wonder Chocolate Factory. Oh, wow, okay. Nope, we're still... Still missing the shiny somewhere. Aha! That's what we like to see. Clear as the blue sky. That was pretty good. We took care of the stronghold in just under an hour. We've got more to, like... <laughs> Yeah, no, I, I, if you missed my, my theory from the other day, I'll say it again, I'll just make it shorter. I'm convinced Mother Miranda knew that Heisenberg was going to betray her, because she's this omniscient, omnipresent mold thing. And the fact that every other lord has the flask except Heisenberg, 
But Heisenberg knows that he needs Rose to beat Mother Miranda, so he's like, hey, yeah, I've got a test for you. Go up to this stronghold and get my flask. That I'll know you're worthy. It's like, Heisenberg, why don't you just have the flask? All the other lords got to hold on to theirs. Why is yours in a stronghold in the exact opposite direction of your domain, guarded by mindless lichens who are only loyal to Mother Miranda? Can you explain that, Heisenberg? You think you have memories? A family, a farm, a plane, what? a crash. You're the real deal, Ethan. Well done. Quit hiding, asshole. I'm not letting you get out of this. <laughs> cool your jets. Not Just jets. A more, <laughs> Machine guy. Wrapped up. I'll lend you a hand. So in exchange. In exchange what? First of all, come to me. Put all the flasks in the altar, and I'm sure you'll figure the rest out. See you, Ethan. Now, God yeah, there it. is, like, a workstation here, so this clearly looks like Heisenberg's, like, secondary domain. But I like my theory better. Otherwise, Heisenberg chose to left his... to leave his flask in, in an ancient structure guarded by lichens on the opposite side of town for no reason. And tested Ethan for no reason. If you want to team up with somebody to take down a greater evil, you don't test them. <laughs> Ah, yes! Googly Elbow's plate! There it is! The plate of Googly Elbow himself. Oh, that's right! I remember where we get let out. Speedboat. Tunnels. Remember Resident Evil 4 in the cave system with the boat? I will say, the first time I came through here, I have expected to jump out and just have a merchant there like, WELCOME! Also, it would have been funny if the Duke was just sandwiched in here. Oh, oh, that's right. That's right, there's a little, there's a little bit of stuffing things down here. Some backstory. And some assholes. Backstory and assholes. <clears throat> Photo of a phantom fish. Yeah, yeah, we already got the finest fish. We got that decades ago. Cadeau implementation note, subject 174181, subject 174, Mikhail M, characteristics 21 male, silversmith, scars from pneumonia. Results low affinity, Cadeau failed to grow, body transformation drop in cognition, another like, and sent to pasture. <laughs> subject 177, Bernadette B, characteristics 21 female, no occupation, no history of illness, results, death, sent to pasture. Subject 181, Alcina D, characteristic 44, female, noble descendant, not from the village, heredity, blood disease. Result, very high affinity, no loss of cognition, arbitrarily able to control body transformation, applied cognition control procedure, sent for observation. My god, what does it mean? I'm gonna save the pipes and the soup cans for the big man I gotta take up up ahead. Lol. Lol. I could kill them, and they'll probably have some skulls, but uh, nothing I really care about, so... Burn in hell, you zomboid fucks! Ah, the fresh air of a graveyard. Down we go. Alright, we'll talk to the Duke, see if we can get some upgrades. If we can't, we'll do what we can with what we have. Like, they established a whole past in the village. Like, this lady, too, the hero of the village, who slayed monsters, and she's on the door to the castle of Dimitrescu, and yet we get nothing more about that. 
Like, the village has a mystique, and, and clearly the village worships Mother Miranda. That's fine, you know, they got that religious aspect going. It's my greatest pleasure to see you return alive. It's my greatest pleasure just to see As you, Duke. You wish. All right, no free ammunition for the for the mag, so we're gonna use what we have. We also might be able to get away using the shotgun on this thing. That might very well be what we do. Let's Please sell off do our take goods. A look at my new stock. Four of those, one of those, two of those, one of those. Nine crystal skulls, a perfect crystal skull. Oh, lost my place there. Crystal hammer, googly elmo mouth plate. Ah, now to spend like kings. He actually has landmines for sale. Hmm. Do let me know if you find anything else of value. All right. How much cash do I have? If it's just looking, window shop away. <sighs> that shotgun is so damn expensive. I think I can afford this, though. Ah, it's only 200 points. Never mind. No love for the magnum. Please. All right. Come again. Here we go. We got two big old boys to take care of. We'll start with the one up in the field. A little bit of these, a couple of soup cans, and I think we'll be fine. That's the hope and the prayer, anyway. One thing this game suffered from was, um, and me and a friend talk about this a lot, arbitrary invisible walls for enemies. Like, uh, like Lady Dimitrescu is the perfect example. In the castle, she chases you, and that would be scary and tense, except you can duck into the Duke's room, and then she just looks at you like, GRRRR! I can't go in there. Even certain parts of the castle, you go in and she's like, darn, if only I could follow. And it just completely removes you from the horror, from the experience, from being trapped. Like, all right, it's lurking up there. The big furry bastard. The question is, I don't know if it can chase me in the house, which again, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be cheesing the shit out of this thing. A soup can for you. A soup can for me. A nice big old magnum. Where's my first soup can? Gotta make sure he runs into that. A big man! Big man! Big man! Did I miss that third one? I might have. To make use of some free shotgun ammo. Hey, big man! Did I really just try to push a wolf back? Alright. Go! My arms were made for blocking! How is my health looking? Pretty good! Oh, not good! Not good! Very bad! Got free handgun. Trying to punch him more. <laughs> Touch and go. Crystallized ancient beast. Very good. All right, we're gonna go get some free ammo from the Duke <laughs> for those guns. Uh, I might even not reload the rifle. I might be able to get. 
yeah, I'm the, the next time I meet the Duke, I might be able to get upgraded rifle capacity. So, if we can get free ammo across the board, I will take it. None of our guns are loaded. Let's equip the knife. <laughs> Uh, let's, uh, uh, that's my last herb, but we do need health. We got some pipe bombs. Very good, 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 very good. And we still have one flash and one explosive. Okay. Cheers, everyone. We did it. Now, uh, now, Ratty Brad, I know you said you were lurking, so you might not uh, be able to hear this, but I'll just pontificate to anyone who's listening. So I, I just mentioned that I think Moreau is responsible for making those wolf creatures because, you know, he experimented with blood in the spine. But that one right there, the crystallized beast specifically, you look at it and it looks like it's been around for years and then you read the description. Crystallized remains of a prehistoric looking creature. That means that at some point, if, if there's not a lack of translation and if I'm not reading too much into this, this creature came about like during the fucking caveman age. And that makes sense, because the Megamycete is established as being an ancient creature under the ground, so it could have been affecting things that died in this area. But if this prehistoric creature came about, and then Moreau made one by injecting wolf blood into the spine of one infected with a kid, it just, it's sloppy. It's just kind of sloppy. And not in the fun way that usually goes about with your mother, just in the unfun, sloppy way. Naturally. Duke, free ammo. Duke! Mm, 18 grand for free ammo on the shotgun. We'll hold off until the next time I see him, because I'm going to run into him in the L of O, but if... Yeah, I don't know the area too well. I know I've got to run from that thing, and I plummet down into the bottom, so now, you know, I still... Let's do it. Delighted to. Let's invest in it. All right, free ammo, free ammo, we'll wait on that. We'll try and get free ammo on that. And we're just waiting to get our better shotgun. But everything's looking pretty okay. All right, so, ooh, but... Damn it, I forgot. Shit, I forgot. I need to go, I can't go to Heisenberg's factory until I head up to Beneviento. Mmm. I still have one more big bastard to take care of. I might be I might be taking him out with a plethora of pipe bombs. One scrap, one gunpowder. I can do that. All right, we've got four pipe bombs that we're going to huck at this man. Rusted chem and gunpowder. We can do that. Two rusted, one chem gunpowder. That's probably better. I don't want to reload the rifle. I might also have to use my grenade here, but it is what it is. We gotta go up to Beneviento. We have to we have to get our treasure. Ah, another trek across the misty rickety bridge. Every time the gardener wanted to go into the village to get produce, he had to make this fucking walk. I'm, I'm, I'm picturing, like, an 80-year-old man with a bad hip who's, like, struggling across this bridge to be like, I've got to get the mistress her meat. <sighs> Put it up here quick, because I almost feel like... I thought I remember the ball, like, actually being right next to the thing. Yeah, no shit, there's a thing, there's a reason for it. And I don't think the ball is in the grave. I think it's just a treasure, but maybe I'm wrong. Maybe maybe the ball is in the grave. No, that's right. Oh, but that means we should be able to find the goats. I think there's goats up here. Oh, wait. Ah! There it is. Either I completely missed that on my first run through, or when you come back, I think, cause yeah, when you come back here, I think you found it dug up. 
Which is interesting. I, I believe that's how it goes anyway. All right, with that, every mystery is is deciphered, uncovered, figured out. We've done it. We got one more big man to take care of, and then it's onward to highs in the Borg's factory. Oh, I just wanted to cheat. Come on. Come on. No, no, no. Other way. Other way. Yeah. Yeah, okay, this one's not too hard. This one's actually kind of fun. It's just run it down the mountainside. Heisenberg's is the worst. Heisenberg's has like five places it can fall off. It's just a terrible fucking contraption. The Chartreuse? Oh no, Onyx. The Onyx skull. Man, why did this man have four wives? Why did they all have different colored skeletons? Why these chains? Why Johnny? All right, who's ready for our second big man of the stream? Technically our third, but our second version of this particular axe-wielding big man. We're gonna riddle him with pipe bombs and handgun bullets. That's the plan, anyway. Fuck you! Do you fear death? We gotta get Zambo 1 and 2 together. That is exactly what I needed to happen. Thank you, sir. Whoop. And we're gonna hold off the other two for when he summons more creatures. Probably gonna shotgun central this man. Haha, <laughs> stupid. Big dumb stupid. together. Hold it together, hold! The power of my arms compels you! These meaty triceps will see me through! I leave one zombie alive. Actually, he doesn't spawn more, I think. Time to heal. And we even got our- oh! Wait a minute. There we go. And we even got ourselves another herb, so... There we go. He took out the last one himself. We need all you pretties together. It's not together, young man. That's a little better. Fine. Oh! That's not nice. Shit. Now oh, he's berserking. Ah, we'll kill him with the knife. That's a good trick. That was the flash. Actually, you know what? We'll kill him with the knife. We shall not kill him with the knife. Oh, uh, golly gee willikers, it looks like I'm gonna have to reload. I don't want to reload! But I'm running out of health. And we're not killing him with the knife. 
More pistol. Could you not? Could you fuck off? Ooh, well, we need that. All of this for a piece of treasure. Now, you know what? Makes the most sense to just reload with this. And not miss our shots! Why are you so big an asshole? Craft ammo, it says. Crafty's nuts! All right. Ooh, the lolly. That man kicked our dick in. And for what? For cash! That was totally worth it. Cash is always worth it. Claudia Beneviento, give me Baron Gario's chalice! And take a look at your daughter's skull. Yikes, alright. Goodbye forever, House Beneviento. We're back to the Duke. To spend the money we just made on more ammunition. Uh, no, I used my flash and my explosive. So, oh, you motherfucker. How many of you are there, goats? I don't have the bullets. I don't need the meat, but you know what? I need the money. Don't, don't, don't. Just don't. How do you push through me? I can't push through things. Why can you push through things? You're a goat! I really can't tell if the animals actually hurt. I, I'm i in blue health, but those, like... No, they're going away. Yeah, I... I don't know. I don't think animals hurt. They're just annoying. Duke, I'm bloodied and befuddled, but I've got treasure to sell you. Which is all gonna go towards the shotgun. Once more across the rickety bridge. We'll, uh, we'll head into Heisenberg's factory and we'll start it. I don't know how far we'll go in Heisenberg's factory. I don't think I'm going to do the whole thing today. I'll probably uh, save most of it for one more stream. We'll take on Heisenberg. We'll take on Mother Miranda. And that will be Resident Evil Village in the bank right next to 7 and 4 and eventually maybe even 5. Shall I choose something for you? I can take a hit of that cigar if you don't mind. It's a lot of money. Now this is something to splurge on. Ugh, I don't have any more free. Damn it. This simple modification can be done in just a moment. All right, we're not. Yeah, we're 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 not gonna upgrade the shotgun. We've got five more rifle, which means by the time we see the Duke again, we should probably be able to upgrade the rifle, and we've got an okay amount of handgun. Handgun takes two and two, really. That's a lot. Two rusted, one. And we only got one chem fluid left. We don't want to spend on that. Pipe bombs are metal scrap and gunpowder. That's actually handy. They take herbs. Yeah. Now let's uh. Let's whip up two pipe bombs, so we've got to get out of jail free card. Hopefully we'll find some grenade ammunition somewhere, somehow, somewhere. Alright, up the cliff! Flasks in the chalice! And then on to the factory of the highs. On to the factory of the one who knocks. 
I mean, all of this cool, breathtaking, four lords, ancient structures, something about bloodlines in the ancient village, but why, how, when? Gimme, give gimme, give gimme give more, gimme, give gimme. Give Oh. Oh, I was big dumb, everybody. I don't know why I thought the flask area was up here. It's not. It's right back where I already was. But hey! Padding our time! Oh, by the way, I've got my Bluetooth headphones so I can hear you while I make bread. <laughs> Wonderful! Wonderful! Make bread that the Duke would be proud of, ratty brat. There we go. Flask. Kakonk. I forget that you can put these flasks in here at any point in the game. Oh, God, the memories. Look, it's my infant daughter before she was vivisected. What was that? Aw, cute. Baby's first memory, getting chopped into pieces by four fucking abominations. And finally, the flask of Dimitrescu. And now we just pick up this two to three hundred pound onyx monument. We'll just stuff that in our pants. What? Duke, did that further your inventory? You wish to make a purchase? It did not. Finished? Are you sure you have everything? Yes, Duke, yes, I have everything. Everything I need for now, anyway, before you get the good shotgun. Oh, we're getting our cardio in today. Not me, I skipped cardio yesterday and I got canes. What's going on? But you know what, it was fucking delicious. I swear they just changed the oil. The chicken was hot and fresh. It was so good, I really want to go back today and get canes again. All right, now let's put down the uh, the deadlift device, the giant's chalice. Let the baby reunification commence. And for some reason, that activates the stone bridge. Alright, it's an elevator. I don't like tight spaces. I don't like tight spaces. I don't like tight spaces. <laughs> nah, this is okay. I've accepted my new reality. Well, while the elevator gently churns ever downward, I can't thank you all so much for being- can't thank you all enough. I thank you so much. Thank you guys for being here. Thanks for joining me this morning and for any of my streams that you come into. Really do appreciate it. My, uh, my, my subscriber Don't follower worry about account. The kid, even. It'll be fine. Ha! If someone Just get your ass across the bridge. If someone said that about your recently chopped up daughter with that tone, would you believe it? Don't worry about your daughter. They'll be fine. Ha! I, I, that kind of makes me want to turn back and pick up the chalice and bring it with me. Lord knows I can carry the thing. But seriously, thank you all for being here. Thank you for joining me on these streams. My name is Master Fong 357 And uh, I, I really do. I enjoy playing for people. My follower count is slowly climbing. We're almost to 50. My average viewership is hovering right around ah, three people. Ethan Winters. Welcome. I didn't think you'd make it past Daughter Moreau. But I suppose you survive worse back in America, hmm? How would you know? I like you. No, you don't. I'd like to speak to you about Rose and Miranda. Oh, come on in. Don't worry. It's not a trap. Oh, well, there you go, everybody. That what settles it. It's not a trap. So let's get on in there and meet our new best friend. 
don't know why that segment, that always reminds me of the segment from Venture Brothers where they're trapped in the Egyptian tomb and they're about to be crushed by the spikes. And Brock's like, all right, kids, well, you heard your father, so you might want to line yourself up so that the spikes either pierce your brain or your heart. Come on, come on, no sense in bleeding to death. I, I belong to the cult of Venture. I, I highly recommend it to anyone who's never taken the time. I remember there being scrap. I thought there was I thought there was scrap I could pick up hanging around here by all these machines. I swore there were bits and pieces of scrap, and I need scrap right now. Scrap is life. Alright, I am not currently finding scrap. Oh! Scrap. Hooray. Vindication and validation. Scrap for the poor, tin, copper, iron, aluminum, aluminium. Yeah, metal scrap. Very good, very good. This place looks cozy. Oh, Gunbalda. I think I'm always I'm trying to figure out why I pronounce some things. I I mean I like to just mispron mispronounce things on purpose, but that one in particular I think that's from Time Splitters too, the very first level where you're in I think the Siberian Dam and the the uh, soldiers are down in the dark with the flashlight. And he's like I'm telling you I heard the gunshots, and then they get eaten by zombies. Great game. Well, you know, true to his word, he said it wasn't a trap, and so we'll just stroll in, meet our new best friend, thank our lucky stars that we don't have another section of this game to go through. Now that Heisenberg has, has guaranteed us that it's all A-OK. -okay. What the hell? Mother. Mia? Yes, that's your wife. True. It's a picture. <gasps> Let me guess. You're thinking, take me out like the others, and then he gets to go and save Rose, right? I'm healing my daughter. Look, you, you, you got this all wrong. Tell him to. Shut your fucking hole! I'm sorry about that. Take a seat. Well, that looks like a trap, though. But, no, I mean, all Listen, right, he said it wasn't. Ethan, you're being played. What are you talking about? You think this is a game? I said sit! <sighs> all right. I'm sitting. Lady, supersized bitch. Ugly, a psycho doll. An amoronic freak. Don't you get it? It's a test. To see if you're strong enough to be a part of Miranda's family. I don't want to be a part of Miranda's family. Neither did I, but here we are! And I'm next in line, right? Kill me, move up the chain, well fuck that! I don't give a damn about your personal issues. I just want to fix my daughter. <laughs> so do I. Do you have any idea how powerful a kid is? Even Miranda's scared of her. Last time, you freak! I swear to God! Maybe you should feed him. This guy looks like Bo Burnham, and no one can change my mind. <laughs> Together, we can go save Rose, and we can use her to grind Miranda into this pace. This is just a white woman's Instagram, my Ethan. is not a weapon. Fuck you! <laughs> Wait a minute, but you said it wasn't a trap! Last chance. Are you telling me he lied? You don't want to find out what's in that hole. You don't want to find out what's I'll in your mother's hole! Oh, bam! Yes! Your funeral. Ah! Ah! Oh, why did ah! I sit so close to the ah! hole? Ah! 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 Ah!
and my little pop gun is definitely gonna do something about that. And we're running! Shit. Oh no! The doors are closing! Everything is scary! There's no possible way we could survive! Hopefully, there's a very well-placed okay, vent that we can... Oh, shit! <laughs> The leg bone's no longer connected to the leg bone. The foot bone's no longer connected to the leg bone. All the bones are trashed and broken. Help, we need medical assistance. Oh, th this room's annoying, because it's not really important. You know, it's just like a bunch of scrap, but you gotta find the scrap. The scrap's everywhere. <gasps> Look at all this twisted metal. Wink. We'll find the path to salvation, Ethan. Climb the rusted mountain top. That's the way up, that's the way down. <sighs> This place, this place is a tetanus factory. This place, this place is a tetanus factory. Oh. Nice. Old metal scrap. You dumb motherfucker, Ethan. Do you want a key change? Oh, that's right. Yeah, there are some enemies here. Fucking and fucking annoying. You know what? N no! I almost lost that pipe bomb. How annoying would that have been? Fuck you! Holes. Right. Yeah, we did it. All right, we got everything. All right, channel your Gordon Freeman, Ethan. Channel it. Find the crowbar. Save the world. Forget, do we are we let out right next to the Duke or do we have to activate something for ah, I can't remember this section too well. I know that I like it. I am a big fan this of the place factory. Is messed up. I've what was what was your first clue? What, what what made you think oh this this place this place is messed up. This place is Ew. It's almost like there's bad things going on here. Duke Yay! Thanks Duke, for your consistent patronage. I've expanded my services. That's not all you've expanded. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Alright. Is it here yet? It is! The SYG-12, a semi-automatic shotgun that focus shots make it powerful against single enemies, customizable for even more firepower. Starts at 1160. 11 fucking 60. 960, my triple upgraded secondary shotgun. I mean, really? Alright, so, uh... Bon voyage, Mr. Tactical. Mm -hmm. Do you have enough firepower? I can now offer an expanded nice. weapon modification service. Yeah, give me that free ammo. Oh, shit, this one- I don't know why I didn't pay attention. This one never gets an ammo upgrade. So that just means I am out of magnum rounds. Duke, do you sell magnum rounds? Duke? Duke? Oh, hey, he's got extra baggage, too. That's nice. But before we do that, let's buy into our shotgun. 180 large, but you know what? <laughs> it's worth it. All right, I completely forgot about this gun. I, I never get it because it's so late game. Technically, it is a handgun. 
when you upgrade it fully, it's not very impressive. It, it's not, like, automatic. Uh, its damage is insane, but... Yeah, no, thank you. All right, uh, here we go. SYG12 red dot. Increases firepower and rate of fire. Oh, if I get the increased capacity cylinder, that might give me free ammo. We'll have to say. I'm uh, definitely going to get this. Yes, I can... Yeah, throw that on for me. And see why right, hang on, Duke. Them. Please come again. Oh yeah, the good shotgun. That for some reason takes up more space. Like, they, they, I mean, just look at this thing. It looks like a compact tactical shotgun, and it takes up more space than a long ass pump action. Whatever. All right, free ammo for that. If I get the cylinder, I think that'll increase my ammo. I'm not sure, yeah. but it might be worth ah, it. Yes, yes. All right, this... 29 for power. Actually, I actually have two capacity upgrades, so I can use this and get more free ammunition. Oh, I do so love greed. I'm not gonna upgrade anything on that bad boy. Uh, 65, yeah, I will put in 65 for now. Ammo capacity on this starts at 10. I'll hold off. We'll be able to get lots of free ammo for this. Uh, yeah, we'll up the reload speed. Ah, it's fine. All finished. Uh, where's that Wolf Bane cylinder? You'll be slot. Bring thing. Huh? Yeah, all right. Wonderful adventure. Nice. Seven free rounds for our Magnum. And the rest is the, uh, oh, yes. the extended barrel, I think, but I don't think he's selling that yet. I will get upgraded inventory space, always. Improved grip. Yeah, none of this, none of this helps us. The knife is sold out. All right. All right, all right, all right. We are looking good. Securing goods. Sold him everything. And anything. anything. Uh, yeah, you know, I'll give another. These give another hands are more upgrade. dexterous than one might think. We'll save those capacities. Twenty-nine. Yeah, we'll upgrade that. Down to a hundred grand. All right. Good day then. All right, we've got a bitchin' shotgun, an upgraded magnum. Massive inventory, I mean massive inventory space, man. All right. Feeling good, feeling flush. Where's your typewriter, Duke? Let's, uh, let's see about going to maybe the second level of the factory here. Take our new weapons out for us, man. Yeah, this, this shotgun's too good. Eventually, we get a long barrel for it. We get a long barrel for the revolver. Yeah, I don't, I don't have any rounds, but I can't give up my herbs. I can't, I can't give up my herb. We got one. We do need to save that pipe bomb, because I think there's a wall that we have to blow open eventually. Man, I feel I feel like I'm getting sweaty for some reason. Yeah, this is the final one, the stupid fucking trolley. Oh, that's right, the trolley. Fuck you, you tiny little fucking piece of shit. Fuck you and your delivery system. You bitch ass device, you horrible fucking gimmicky contraption ass bitch. <coughs> <coughs> I'm fine. I'm perfectly fine. Level-headed, how are you? I'm completely sane. Ah, that's right, these contraptions. Open! Growl at me. 
It's not my fault you're horribly designed and inefficient. Mother! How do you still have your headpiece? Quite the amount of ammunition these things require. <clears throat> Pieces of the map are coming back to me. Little by little, I do recall certain aspects. There's not enough power. Oh fuck, that's right, I have to deal with the Iron Maidens eventually, which means I definitely am going to need to bone up on more explosivos. Uh, Alright. For now. We're in, a, we're in a scrap factory! We're totally gonna find tons of metal scrap, right? Please God. Please God, give us scrap. I've got a I've got an upgrade for this thing. So Thank you. Ooh, double herbs. Yes, please. Yes, double herbs. Mm, we got some more ammo. Seven more shots with this bad boy before the dookie gotta do his tinker tanker. His tinker tom buffoonery. Rusty scrap. Yeah, that's right. The metal mode. Lock from the other side! Who would have guessed it? Certainly not me. This place is pretty straightforward. Uh, which I liked about the factory. It's confusing, but, like, it is a straight line. And you just work through the areas you haven't been to yet. I hate the zombies. I don't know why I hate them so much. I don't know if they're deserving of my abject hatred, but they just soak up so many bullets! Yellow quartz. Gunpowder. No power. Ah, I first sold that. And that's what this bad boy's for, right here. Why are still here scuffling? Are you down below? Or are you in the other room? What the? Uh, oh, oh! Look at that! We can actually take out the sh take out the things from here. Fascinating. All right, enough of that. Did he do this too? No, clearly this is just an act of God. This is this is just this is just nature. We are the virus. Nature is healing. Who the fuck do you think did it, Ethan? Who the fuck do you think was responsible? Oh no, it stood up! <laughs> Peekaboo! Ah, oh, I love this shotgun. This shotgun is bay. Again, the power's still out, so yeah, we need to head back down. Finally, some relief. Wink. So, I'm running so low on handgun ammo.
Now, we did just pour molten hot metal, but let's pick it up with our bare hands. <laughs> Seems useful. I don't think these hands can feel anything anymore. There go our lockpicks. Ooh, magnum ammo, all right. That'll help us later. Fuck, that is so much gunpowder. And scrap! Down we go. Oh, you know, maybe I shouldn't have done that. As I recall, these machines can actually kill some of the bastards down here. Whoops. Here's me jumping the gun, doing my gamer thing. Thinking I got the big strats. Three more shotgun shells. you in anything all of the time a little bit of anything all of the time well, that's a lot of zombies Umpa! our Elden Ring break yesterday, and uh, we've been crunching through, oh, thank God, we've been crunching through RE8, uh, we're going to be ending the stream soon here, I'm going to try and get back to the Duke, I went through the mill today, I took care of a bunch of big assholes, and tomorrow will probably be our last stream here, we'll finish up the factory and take on Mother Miranda. Hey zombies, can you uh can you come here and get, get get crunched for me? I'd appreciate it. I don't wanna I don't wanna have to use any more ammo than I need to. Zombies? Look! A boogity boogity boogity! It's me, Ethan Winters! Oh, damn. I mean, it hits you, I suppose that's good. No, you don't. That's nice. That one paid attention. Very good, very good. These machines aren't, like, important. <laughs> Ten seconds until detonation. Ooh, I actually took a beating. <laughs> Nothing a quick splash to splash you won't fix. Take care, Addy Brat. Say hi to Josh for me, you know, I'll probably head over there for a few minutes after I'm done here. Because I, I can't imagine we'll be longer than about five more minutes here. Thanks for stopping in. My wife is awake! And I didn't even know it. Alright, I gotta go back there. Eventually. 
More Gordon Freemaning. All right. And we're up to a whole five people here too. This is great. Hello, everyone. I'm sorry you might have come in a little late here. We're uh, well. No, we've still got some. We've still got some block from the other side. Why? Why? We've still got a lot to deal with here. We uh, have to turn the power on, and that's gonna make all these assholes very, very angry. There we are. Can I? I can. If I run all the way back, I can get to the Duke for my free ammunition. Because if I... Aha! There it is! How much do I have here? Yeah, we still... Yeah, we got enough. Hi, sweetheart! Mm, good. Shotgun. Oh, good. Medical... Me medical... Metal cylinder. Yeah, so... Backup generator. I need to find the cockpit. Alright, so we're not turning the power on just yet. Which uh. means that we haven't woken up the factory, which works. Stealthy wife. Yeah, she is very stealthy. She is small and stealthy. It's been a while since we've had a mighty soup can. Did my... Are you kidding me? Oh! Oh, I thought my game just crashed. It's gonna be like, well, uh, there's the stream for the day, folks. No, we, we had a bit of a... We had a bit of a stutter step there, but everything's okay now. Oh dear, oh dear. Alright, up the steps. Or whatever the hell this thing is. Big red glowing lights. What is this, Sonic? I'm trying to be Dr. Eggman, Heisenberg? Factory map, lower level. Mechanical soldier, sold at. Version 1.0. Fully grown male corpse used. Removed heart and implanted cadaver. Muscle stimulation via electric shock was successful. Brain dead, so no high cognitive ability. Only moves by destructive instinct and stops. Mechanical soldier sold at version 1.01. Attached headgear to the cranium. Electrodes confirm stable brain waves. Experiment one, lichen fight. Was dismantled and eaten within three minutes. Issues with destructive and murderous capabilities. <laughs> Version 1.10. Replace lower part of arm with drill. Not enough output for effective movement. Need live bodies, perhaps? Implanted Kano reactor into the chest. Output greatly increased. Experiment 2 lichen fight. Destroyed three lichens in one minute. Good results, but tissue with reactor durability may stop functioning if the reactor is destroyed. Really? Really? If the reactor, if the core of the thing is destroyed, it might stop- Wait, that cut off their heads! Without their heads, they're defenseless! This man's a genius. There we go, there's the cog mold. Okay. That wants me to head back down here. staring at why isn't your reactor online that was a nice like anime swipe you had there it was very like it was very naruto you're gonna pay for that i don't think punching the metal frankenstein is the way to go ethan call me crazy Well, clearly we need to spend more money on our shotgun firepower. Oh, you whore. That's alright. 
We actually, oh, that's right, we got, uh, we got some explosivos. That's good for us. Very, very good for us. Alright. You know what I'm gonna do here? Uh, let us put in the cog mold. I'm gonna get the cog, I'm gonna go back up to the Duke, and I'm gonna end it for the day. Uh, tomorrow we'll turn on the power, and that's when things will really start to spice and sizzle. Plus, you know, we gotta go get our ammunition from the Duke. Thank you, Lodge Cog. I ordered the extra Lodge Cog with sausage. Yeah, these are the quality jokes you can come to expect, people. This is, this is what we're here for. Yeah, tomorrow we'll turn the power on and uh, everything's gonna kick off. I do love the design of this place. I, I like it. I was, I was like, you know, factory junkyard, and the uh, the enemies too. I, I, I'm a, I really love enemy variety. That's a big deal for me. So it was great to see some more enemies in the third act. I thought this was all we were gonna get: slow zombies, lichens, and guy with axe. Ah, yes, yes. Hello, Duke, my fine feathered fellowed friend. I've got crystal hearts and all sorts of wondrous pieces for you. Hard times, Ethan. No, shut up! You're hard times! Shut up! Oh. Jerk. Alright, if I buy that power upgrade, I will have no money left. And I want to make sure I at least have money for more free ammunition. So we'll hold off. Oh yeah, I've got to remember that I've got free ammunition for the snipers. So that's going to come in handy. We're going to use that to annihilate the soldiers. And I don't think he has any more... Upgrades, so, all right. Have a wonderful adventure. Very, very low on pistol ammo. All right, that's that's it. That's all you get, pistol ammo. That's the last. I can't be dishing out all this gunpowder. I need it for stuff. All right, and there we are. Let's just focus on the Duke's wondrous physique right here as I do my outro. So thank you all so much for being here today, even if it's for a little bit, if it was for the whole time, really, it, it, it very much helps. Again, my name's MasterFong357, I upload all of my streams straight to YouTube once I'm done with them at the same handle, MasterFong357. Unless you're watching this at YouTube, in which case, hi YouTube people, thanks for stopping by. Please consider giving me a follow, a like, a subscribe, or whatever, what have you. If nothing else, hey, just come back and lurk. I don't mind lurkers. As long as I see a little number down there that someone out there is watching me, in my madness and my misery and my embarrassing identity. <laughs> that works for me. I hope you all had as much fun watching this as I had fun playing it. Please check out my, my past streams, my YouTube. I've got a lot of other games I've played. Uh, Streets of Rage, a lot of Resident Evils, clearly. Elden Ring. And I've got a, a lot of games coming up in the future I hope to play. Prototype, Sekiro. Um, oh, I do Stardew Valley with my wife. We've been having a lot of fun with that. And that's been kind of a casual stream, so you can expect more of those videos soon. We started at the very beginning, uh, and we are amassing our fortune, so we're, we're making it. We're trying to make it in that crazy world. <laughs> uh, I'm sorry, I'm just reading my chat here. So again, yes, thank you all so much for being here. It, uh, I, we're close. We are so close to affiliate status. I need nine more followers, and I, just a few more days of streaming with an average of three people. And I mean, we've got four in here right now, so that is just fantastic. That is above and beyond anything I could have hoped for. You know, hopefully by the end of the month, I might reach affiliate status, and then I can figure out where the hell I go from there. But if not, you know, I'm gonna keep doing this, because it's a lot of fun, and I've been told by a few people now that they enjoy watching me. So you know what, if I can bring a little bit of joy to somebody out there, or, or just kill a little bit of time for someone who, as I said at the beginning, maybe you're in a plane right now, try, waiting to taxi, or maybe you're at the bus stop, and you just wanted to watch somebody scream and yelp and talk nonsense. I'm your guy! So thank you all so much. I uh, hope you have a great rest of your day. Take care, everyone.